see what the girls can go chase. What are they doing? Just waiting for it to clear a little. She's coming in and out of fog, but we've seen a couple of nice gem when we landed, so. What are the ladies up to? So, we have set up our little tent. Camp, tent camp. Yep. We managed to fly in before the rain, but now it is well and truly raining. We're lucky we set up those tents before. Yeah, mm -hmm. we were lucky. We've got Rachel's yeah, awesome, crazy expensive fly. <laughs> 300 bucks for a fly, but right now it's crisp. It's worth it. Yeah, so luckily 300 bucks is proving to work. It's very good, eh? So we're just going to wait out the rain and hopefully it'll stop and we'll go out for a hunt and an explore. Bit of earth moving going on, the old mountain stick, digging trenches. Yee! This thing is honestly sick. Yeah, I want it. mountain stick. I reckon it'll double as like a sick gardening tool. <laughs> Who bought you? <laughs> <laughs> and then we have the ladies. Good morning. We are on day two. And we can actually see the sky and it is not raining as of yet. But we are going to go up over there and hopefully see something. We out of here team. Girls spotted some bulls on the ridge line way <laughs> out beyond there. So that's where we seen the sham yesterday when we flew in. So today's that day. No cloud. Long way that last. Yeah. Okay, we're gonna split off into two groups. We've got Emma and Rach, me and Mons. And we're gonna have a competition on who comes up with the biggest animal. Game on. <laughs> we'll see how we go. We are going on a top of that hill. That hill. Just to see what we can see from the other side of the hill. big rock 
really big rock. Um, we've just walked from down there, that's camp. Come up here, along the ridge, down, and all the way up here. And we're gonna go up into that fold and over the other side. Here we are, living our perfect spot. Perfect, amazing view spot. See that? See all those stars down there? And we're gonna head over this peak and see what we can see on the other side. Uh, yep. Beautiful. <laughs> Beautiful when the sun comes up, right? Well, we just spooked about five nannies, maybe. They're just running along there, I think. So hopefully we can find some bulls. We're gonna move down towards the scrub a little bit, go over to those jaggedy rocks, see what we can find. We're on the hill, having a brew, because our view is amazing. So we're waiting for it to clear and we're going to have some of our hotel coffees, which is what we got. Our little thing. So she had back. Yep. Whenever I stay at a hotel, I collect all the little coffee and hot chocolate sachets to use when I'm hunting. I'm crafty and cheap like that. Um, yeah. Very handy. Some dry plants. And your jet fire. spotted another chamois and her baby. It might have been the same set as before. I'm not really sure. They're just tucked up in by that rock up in there. Looking quite cozy, quite comfortable. But we're still on the hunt, so we'll see what we can find. So we are on our way back to camp, which is down there. We walked what felt like miles and miles uphill around rocks. We saw a lot of animals, nothing that we think were worthy, but we'll see. We'll see when we get three days on, hey? Um, had a good scope around. Hopefully we'll catch up with the other girls, see how they went. Um, Mons here has her lovely glitter on her eyes. Oh, I'm like well tanned from the sun we had today. That was great. <laughs> yeah, a few minutes, but it was great. Nice yes. warm up. Almost and felt like having a nap. Now we're going back into the fog and probably the rain tonight. We'll see how we go.
What's this happening? Probably nightcap. All our nightcaps are going to be gone before we actually get to have the night. some success. Um, we have Pinot Noir, Central Otago. That was mine. That's yours. Thank you. <laughs> Cheers, Good one. Cheers. Good health. Cheers. Good company and bloody good mountain time. Woohoo! I mean, what else do you do when it rains? Tomorrow's. Got to have that Central Otago wine. It tastes so good in the platypus. The platypus. <laughs> By the way, hydro packs, super good as wine goons. Wine goons. Wine goons. Of fresh sign around here, but I'm pretty sure just be more nannies and young bulls. These big boys are ain't they easy nowadays? Looking in that bloody scrub, and they're gone before you get there and come out after you're gone. But surely, you gotta get lucky someday, don't you? Never give up. Poor old Mons. <laughs> Bit upset she missed her meat animal, but plenty more time for that. When you're new into it, we got a mess, even when we've done it a fair bit. Get the gears up there. Hopefully they got a brew on. Now it's gonna be a long day of waiting, glassing.
well, we've just proven both of us can miss. <laughs> it's fucking hard work. That was my bad, I rushed that shot and my rangefinder wasn't working because of like a bit of fog coming through. <sighs> so, that was my bad. I'm just hoping I haven't hit him because we can't find him, but we can't find any blood either, so. So you didn't. Quite possibly I missed did. him. You wouldn't believe it, but there are frogs up here. We can hear frogs. <sighs> well, we're basically on our last hunting day. And we've just been chasing nannies up the hill. This fog, it's been, it's been killing us. And uh, we got one moment of clarity before where it just all went away. And we saw the nannies that were just up here, right where we freaking are. And there was this mob of damn good looking bulls down the, down the valley. And like, if we had about an hour more of light and like, we could have quite literally probably shot a nanny and gone down the ridge line and had a crack at those bulls. Unfortunately, tomorrow's looking like quite shit weather and I don't think we're gonna make it up here with um, a helicopter that could come at any time. Me and Mons haven't had the best luck, obviously. Um, <laughs> Then he's there, then 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 he's there. It's almost like it's like nanny's right here and like really not close enough to shoot, but it's close enough almost to like the dark came and the clouds came and like <laughs> It's almost like nature wants us to fail. It like gives us a little bit of clarity just to shit on us at the last minute, which is kind of what's happened. I must mean, break. Now we're way up the hill, we're going to have to put torches on and make our way back down to camp. And Monson's torch has not a lot of battery. No. <laughs> but naked running around the freaking town to drip dry because she just had a bath in it. Look at her go. <laughs> run, Varus, run. Well. Bittersweet, but awesome trip anyway. Um, we're going home empty handed, but that's okay. That's okay. Didn't find what we were looking for, but had a mean trip anyway. How could you not in this country? The weather sort of screwed us up a bit now. We've got a pretty parallel of a day. Um, but until we conquer the west coast next time Adios. cheers did you have fun em i did she yep. did epic sweet epic. first west coast mountain hunt so yep. she did bloody good all the girls conquered it like champs yep. no complaining just keep on going more wine next time <laughs> okay cheers then <laughs>
just had the information that over 5,000 5, animals have been shot in the last cull recently, over 2,500 bulls. Um, hence that we didn't see a lot and the ones that we did see were young. Um, so yeah, it's just the way it is. Gonna come out empty handed sometimes, so to let what's left get to a nice mature age. But we had fun, right, girls? Yeah! <laughs> right, catch you on the fly side, but when you're hunting up here, just enjoy the moment. It's not always about taking something home. Beautiful. Apart from country. memories. Mm -hmm. Beautiful piece. Beautiful. And what's up, Jabba Jaws in the back got to say? <laughs> Cheers.